Have you ever seen a dismantled corpse? So Only in the films that I direct. Keep it that way. Trust me. You don't want to see one in real life. Anyway, so, we made it to Matthew's house. All safe and sound. And you're certain this flat is safe? Of course it is. Lots of security, lots of locks. All right, all right. Or so we thought. Shit! Am I right? Like, <laughs> well, you obviously didn't actually die because otherwise you wouldn't be here telling us. Oi! Story. Don't spoil it! Jesus Christ, man! Call yourself a filmmaker. All right, let's switch it up for a bit for dramatic effect. Tell me a story from Matthew's point of view, seeing as your character's now dead. I, I, I can't. It, it's my story. I can't tell it from his perspective. What are you on about? Let someone else shine for a moment. It's very you, 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 you. I mean. Uh, I guess he, he did tell me, so I can kind of put it together. Uh, okay, all right, all right, let's try it, let's try it. Okay, black and white. Let's Christopher Nolan this shit. No one will answer. What the fuck actually happened? Hey. And go on, what is it? Oh, I thought you wanted dramatic effect. No, I want an ending. A dramatic effect isn't just leaving it on a cliffhanger. Well, in my universe, it is. <sighs> fine, fine, fine. I'll give you a little teaser. But only if you get me another drink, yeah? I'm surprised you can still talk with all that beer in you. Well, go on Spielberg, tell me. What would you think that means, huh?